Hola, my name is Ana Valeria and this is a weekend in Rounds. To anybody out there that's interested in coming to Rounds or you're just bored and want to watch a video, hope you enjoy it. One, two, three, fuck it. My darling, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. So today is Saturday. A lot of my friends are just in another European city traveling around. However, I decided to stay in Rounds to explore a little bit more. And now I'm going to a champagne house. morning I went for breakfast in the pink boulangerie near campus they sell the best croissant au saumon however they didn't have croissant au saumon they had croissant à pistache so let's see how it is I hope it is good I swear this is the best croissants ever it's like a little castle here in France I've been here before but to the Ryman Gala like you model United Nations Gala but I want to visit it that day so let's see how it is So this is Ville de Moselle. Sorry for my French pronunciation. And this is me just tasting and smelling the champagne. I honestly not sure what I'm supposed to taste, but sure. Let me act like I actually do. <laughs> Such a pretty house. I completely recommend it. It's amazing, beautiful. Champagne at 10 a.m. I don't know about that, but it is what it is. So this is the entrance to Pomeri Caves. Oh my god, it looks so cool. I need to go upstairs again and come back down because I forgot to download the application for the tour. So annoying. I guess more exercise. I don't know. Okay, okay. The vibes of Pomeri are cool. I like it. Also, I realized I'm drinking another cup of champagne at 11 a.m. This is, this is not good for me. This is not good for me. So I'm taking a walk and I discovered this very cute park near Pomery. Super, super nice. So I just came to Tetanger because last time I came, I saw a cap and I really wanted to buy it, but I didn't. And I was like thinking about that all week. So I came back to Tanchef. I recommend it too, it's quite nice. Um, but they didn't have it. Sad. RIP. <laughs> so I grabbed some lunch from the boulangerie, ate it in front of campus, then went home, took such, such a long nap, and then started cleaning and doing chores. And then for the rest of my afternoon, I just spent it with my host family and went to an event with them. So this morning I woke up, coordinated all the things I needed for Columbia schedule next year. I'm so nervous. And yeah, and now I'm just going to Carrefour. I hope it's open because it's packed. Oh, wow, the boulangerie line. Reopened, this is the only boulangerie that's open. As you can see, a huge, huge line. super convenient about Sciences Po is that you have Sciences Po right there, pharmacy. Car 4 is like literally there, like a one minute walk from here and that's the cathedral. So everything's like super near, like the location. So if you live near Sciences Po, you live near everything. Yeah. Editing this is making me very, very hungry. Okay, now I'm going to the picnic. I have tons of food. I'm very hungry, but oh, it's so sunny, it's so pretty. I'm very excited. It is in this by the canal where a lot of students decide to take their hot girl walks uh, and people can walk. The canal goes from here a very, very long way over there. But it looks very, very pretty today. It's usually not pretty. So there's this little fair going on here in Hans. Quart de Bac. Looks so fun. We'll probably come this week, right? Yeah. Yeah, looks so cool. We just arrived to Leo Lacrange to do our picnic. It's very, very nice. There's even a carousel over there. I was so excited.
We're gonna go up to there. We're gonna we're gonna climb this, right? We're gonna climb it. We're gonna climb it. We're gonna climb it. Now I'm meeting with some friends in the back of the cathedral. This garden is so pretty. A lot of students now, and because it's spring, always hang out here behind the amazing, magnificent cathedral. After two picnics, she's coming to Place Arlo to have dinner and enjoy some time with friends. Zachno, today is Sunday, there's a lot of people. Usually it's not this busy because it's very cold, but it's spring, everybody's outside. And as for the rest of my soiree, I just went to the canal with some friends with this 5 euro pizza and spent the night with my friends and just went home like at midnight. So it was a three day weekend, so in the morning I just studied and try to work with Columbia University course selections and then I went to this very nice park uh, by Basilique Saint-Rémy which is like a three minute walk from Sciences Po very 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 nice great registration does not work the website keeps crashing and I'm freaking out I can't register for courses. This has been so stressful. The website crashed for everyone. We couldn't sign up. Luckily, I was able to register to all the courses I wanted. Um, but yes, it was so, so stressful. Oh my so, God. I'm gonna go for a run now, but something very peculiar about this week is that I didn't have any presentations or any research papers. Thus, I'm very free when it comes to course work. Um, so yeah, that's why I've been able to not study a lot and enjoy more of the city and have time with friends. Something to clarify, this is my weekend in Reims during spring, summer-ish kind of weather. Um, during winter is different. I would say I'll stay more inside, um, stay at my friend's place more often. Like I don't go to the park when it's cold, for example. So when I was going back home, I saw some friends and we decided to go to Place Arlon and buy some ice cream, which didn't make my workout very efficient, but oh well, c'est la vie. And then I joined my friend uh, because she's doing this concert to support Ukraine. Um, and I joined her for a little bit and we sang some songs in the street. So I just sang a song for the concert. My voice is killing me because we had to scream because like a little bit, because we don't have microphones. But it's going well. We have we collected some money for Ukraine. Then I met up with a friend in Place d'Arlon too. And after that, I just headed home, worked a little bit. And yeah, that was my day. So that was my weekend in Reims. Hope you enjoyed this video. This city does not have a lot to do, but it does have its charm. If you have any questions, please let me know. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.